Hey, in this video, I will tell you how we make our custom made suits. And hi, my name is Michael, and welcome to um, my video about custom suits. Uh, because many people have been asking us how, what's the process, how do we actually get to a result when it comes to custom suit, when it comes to moving a flat piece of cloth into this masterpiece. So this is gonna be a short guide, just so you know what's happening through, uh, throughout our kind of first visit, second visit, third visit, that sort of thing. So you get the gist and you kind of try to warm yourself up for the idea of actually making a custom suit with us. So how it works is we book an initial appointment. So we have to decide what we do and how we do it and whether, whether there is something that we see uh, and it resonates with uh, ourselves, with me, with you, about making a suit. So uh, maybe you've got a, a, a big wedding, maybe you've got uh, some keynote talk, maybe you just cannot find something that actually suits you very well off the peg. Then you come and see me, we talk, we kind of, you know, digest some of the stuff uh, that you've got kind of queries about and I need to know how serious you are and how committed you are to actually making a suit with us. That's step number one. So then it's step number two where we um, sit down, get measured. This is usually either at your location or my location. And what happens through the visit, we take a full set of measurements. Um, we're talking about, you know, inside leg, outside leg, chest, arms, biceps, that sort of thing. Everything that we need in order to make your custom suit. Then we put you in one of our master models. A master model is just a jacket that we use for you to try how um, sort of what size would you wear? How would you normally wear your suit? How would you normally move arms about? Is one of the arms dropped and the other is not? So we take a full set of measurements and then we use our master models. On our master models, we actually uh, have got written, you know, what's the length of the jacket. So we say, okay, so in that length, you know, is that enough or should, we, yeah, okay, so what about sleeve? Okay, sleeve length should be a slight, you know, what about armpit? It's very hard to measure accurately in an armpit for you to understand how it's going to fit unless we've got a master models. So master models happens through step number two. And I must admit at that stage we also measure you for a custom shirt. So we take a full measurement for your shirt. Whether you're going to do it or not doesn't really matter but whilst we're there may as well do it. So what happens next? Step number three is a situation where we actually make it a suit and now how busy you are you can refer back to my video about um, what's the latest we can do in terms of suit delivery um, but we're talking about between 3, 7, 14 or maybe 28 days. So it all depends how busy you are, how quickly you want this and also depends on your budget because the, the less time you leave the more expensive it's going to be to deliver it on time. So after making you a suit uh, we are going to step number four which is actually trying that suit on you. So we call it first fitting and first fitting can actually expose a lot of things. It can expose the fact that um, you know maybe the the button that we've created here maybe needs to be slightly widened maybe it's maybe it's too tight here uh, you know maybe it's too loose and we have to take something in in the back or through the side seams that sort of thing so first fitting majority of times is not when you actually gonna keep your suit we still gonna take it we still gonna make it perfect and then then there is another step that's the step number Five. Step number five is when we actually go back to you with a adjusted garment. So whether there's any adjustment that is needed here, maybe the sleeve um, width is too big and you're like, mm, you know what, I don't think I, I like this. And maybe it should be slimmer or it should be slightly bigger because it pulls that sort of thing. That's step number five. And that's it, there's no more steps because usually at the second fitting, your suit is gonna be perfecto, perfecto. 
So are we actually a bespoke tailor? Many people ask. Um, I would say we not because what a bespoke tailor does is they would first create a, a chest piece without any sleeves. Then you would come for the first fitting. They would find and they would make the chest piece. Okay, so your chest piece looks going to make it out, let it in. You come back in three weeks. In three weeks, you're gonna have maybe sleeves added to it. So now they, they measure you. Then after another two or three weeks, you're gonna go for trousers measurement. So they're gonna make you a, a mock-up trouser. Then you're gonna be trying this. They're gonna make an adjustment. So then you wait another three weeks. Uh, then you're gonna come and they're gonna have this ready and, and, and your trousers gonna be ready as well at the same time. So now you then probably 12 weeks after the initial measurement you then try your garment on now this is in our terms this is first fitting in bespoke um sort of tailor terms that's going to be you know fourth or fifth fitting already um so if you've got time that's one thing if you've got money because it costs a lot more than a made to measure suit then bespoke is definitely way to go but what we found is that majority of our clients ring us and they want a suit for yesterday so a bespoke is not an option that's why we're never going to go for a bespoke because it's just too complex um, too many meetings too many appointments and you have to come to us imagine if you live in switzerland and you want a bespoke suit we would have to fly you or fly us to switzerland every two or three weeks that's going to be expensive to sum up five steps that we follow step number one is the initial kind of conversation around the suit or whether you really need a make to measure suit step number two is of course choosing the fabric meeting you uh, talking to you about your needs talking about what you want from that suit where do you want to wear it that sort of thing Number three is when we go out back into our workshops and actually making you a suit. So this is going to be a process that takes the longest. Step number four is the first fitting. First fitting happens uh, again face to face. It has to. You cannot get a haircut over the phone. You cannot get measured for the first fitting over the phone has to be face to face so then we take any adjustments we we adjust sleeves and buttons and that sort of thing and we take the garment with us back to our seamstresses and step number five when we adjust everything and either ship it to you or come and see you again for the second fitting which usually is the last there you have it a very quick process of how we actually make in make to measure suit for you so if you think about do I need one? Do I want one? If you ask yourself that question, that's probably not still the time you should be thinking and buying made to measure suit. You should be buying made to measure suit when you think, I saw what Michael does, I love him to bits, I love every single piece that he made, let's make something together. That's where you come to me and we make you a perfect, perfect made to measure suit. Let me know if you've got any other questions about our process, made to measure, anything related to suits, comment below. 